Our wedding day is finally here. Of all our adventures so far, our marriage will be by far be my favorite. You make me so happy, Luke, and you've helped me to become a better person. Mary, ever since we first met, I knew there was something special about you. Your smile of pure happiness is the first thing that comes to mind. Over the years, it is the one thing I continue to do anything to see every day. We have come today to celebrate the marriage of Luke Francis Ganeum and Mary Kathleen Costers, to ask God's blessing on their marriage and to bring them our love and support. God, our Father, we praise you for bringing us here to celebrate with Luke and Mary. We thank you for their love and trust which has brought them here this day. Unite them by your spirit and bless them with your love. You never cease to amaze me with how you make everything better. Mentally, physically, and spiritually, you have made me a stronger man than I ever thought possible. You are so supportive and the best cheerleader I could ever ask for. You're my favorite person to go on adventures with. You've made me feel like the luckiest person ever. I also never knew falling in love with you would include Tucker. <laughs> <laughs> making it the best two-for-one deal I've ever experienced. Our two years together have truly been incredible. Although we faced many challenging obstacles in that time, you've shown me what an incredible man you are and what love is. <laughs> you have always been there to support me, and no matter what, you go the extra mile to make everything better. <laughs> Mary, I give you this ring and the symbol of our marriage as my constant faithfulness and abiding love. Luke, I give you this ring as the symbol of our marriage of my constant faithfulness and abiding love. Mary is wearing her beautiful hand-picked dress today. And at the wedding of the Lamb, each Christ follower will be given new clothing, fine, bright, and pure, signifying the righteous acts of the saints through Jesus' purifying work, which Mary's dress signifies. She has been practicing driving since the time she was three. Hi, oh, We had this John Deere Gator that was around our house. Thank you. And she ran it so much, I had to change the tires. She made so many tracks around the house, we had her own two-lane road going around the place. So she's been practicing for years and years and years of driving. So she's on the road all the time. And so my thing to you, Luke, is when she wants to drive, please let her drive. But I think I speak for everyone when I'd say you'd be hard pressed to find a better, more genuine and caring friend than Luke. Um, I consider Luke to be one of my brothers, honestly. Luke's someone I can always count on to do anything I need without hesitation. Um, he's a friend that I've always gone to in any situation, and he's never let me down. If you need a dependable friend to be there for you during hard times, you won't find anyone better. Mary, you've truly found a good man to spend the rest of your life with. Mary, it's here. Today is the day that you have dreamed about. It's your wedding, and it's beautiful, just like you. Several weeks ago, uh, Andrew and I had a bonfire and Mary came to join us. And when she did, she told us of the devotions you've been doing, the fun, fun adventures you go on, and how full life is with you. She told me then with tears in her eyes, because both of you are super sappy, and a deep contented look that she can't live without you. And I'm grateful for that moment. One, that I could be with my sister at a bonfire on the farm, and two, that she's found somebody who her soul desires. As a minister of the Church of Christ and by the authority of the Commonwealth of Virginia, I now pronounce you, Luke and Mary, husband and wife, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. Luke, you may kiss your bride. Today, I'm committing the rest of my life to loving and serving you. I know God made you for me. I vow to always stand by your side for the rest of our lives. 
I will never stop loving you, and I will continue to fight for your love to this day and every day forward. I love you so much, Mary, and I will for the rest of my life. I'm truly honored to be up here today and to be given the opportunity to speak about each of you. Luke and Mary, I wish you all the best in life and I know you will both succeed when things seem impossible and that you will cherish and appreciate every moment when life couldn't be better. Um, you both have so much to look forward to and this is just the beginning. I love you both and I'm excited to watch the life you create together.